This is an Abyssinian. Anywhere between nine to a thousand dollars for a pet ball eddy. They're called the Sphinx. They run between thirteen and fifteen hundred dollars on average. The Savannah. The pet quality cats usually go from between a thousand and two thousand dollars. Bengals. The pets usually start at the base of $800 up to like 12 or 15, depending on how fancy their coats are. These little guys have very little hair. They feel like a rubber ball. It's an investment, but if you take care of them, they'll live to be 20 to 25 years old. Uh, they get along with anyone. Um, when you have people come to visit your home and you have these little guys, they will be your first greeters of anybody that comes into your home. But they call him the dog of the cat world. Very, very loyal, uh, very active, very happy, very astute to things around them. I always say that if you're going to have a party, they always think the party is about them. What the breeders originally did was they took the African serval and they bred it with a domestic cat and they got a savanna. They are lab cats, they crawl under the cover with you at night. They are not in your face type of a cat, but they're very dog-like where they're always by your side. The Asian leopard cat is crossed with a domestic plain old tabby. They're extremely high energy. Um, they seem to be pretty disease resistant, um, high climbers. These guys are dog-like enough that you can train them. They retrieve, wad up a piece of paper and throw it, and they'll go get it and bring it back to you over and over and over again.